Hey all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for July 18th, 2018. The character is the defect and the modifiers are heirloom, start with one rare relic, certain future, the map contains only one path, and binary, card rewards contain only two cards. Now thanks to certain future, um, the scores are not going to be super high because the number of elites is going to be limited. But uh, let's see, uh, let's see how this goes. All right, the rare relic we got is Unseizing Top. Whenever you have no cards in hand during your turn, draw a card. So this means we should try to maximize zero cost cards. That way we can sort of get rid of everything in our hand. Um, let me actually quickly think, let's do dual cast. All right, target the wrong guy twice. Uh, we can actually save one HP by, um, or just lose one HP by playing both defense cards rather than any other way which would have made us take more damage and then uh, two strikes kill perfect all right yeah this does not help with my goal to do well since we have done seizing top recycle might be nice it will exhaust a card it will give us um, energy and basically get rid of two cards at once and give us energy um, all right so I was kind of looking for zero cost cards we did get bandage up but that's not it's not an ideal zero cost card so sunder might be when do we have an elite coming up oh just one elite close to the end at this floor um so sunder might work great with our um recycle but other than that it will sort of inhibit us from doing anything uh, tough decision all right i think I think we'll take it though. It's a very good card. Like, especially in this floor. Let's take it. If it gets to kill somebody, like in this case, it is going to help us with our unseizing top quest. Um, Alright, here, I don't think we can kill this turn, right? So we'll just do zap, um, one strike, and then defend. Actually, never mind. It would have killed this turn. No, I forgot we had a second thing. That's fine. We killed this... Wait, did we... We did lose 1 HP. Alright, so that 1 HP was unnecessary. Alright, Claw. This is what I was looking for. Zero cost card. Um, incentivize having more of. Um, here, we are going to take 11 damage unless we defend. So I think we'll double defend. Just to decrease our damage to 1 HP and not play this under. Which I think is fine. Alright, so Claw. Deal cast. Now, this is a good example. We can recycle defend. Do the strike and then draw another strike and if we had drawn well i guess the only other thing we could have drawn was the claw to actually make it work because we ran out of energy but this is sort of the thing i'm imagining with the recycle oh perfect second claw although the boot sequence would have been nice but i think it's fine um so again actually this is perfect so we'll recycle the sunder and now we can play pretty much everything now, the problem is that uh, it will be very difficult for us to pick up the Curses modifier because that one will break our unceasing top cycle unless we get uh, the relic that allows us to um, play it. We can't kill this turn, right? Uh, the relic that allows us to play uh, curse cards, which is somewhat unlikely, so we'll see how that goes. At this point, though, I think I will try to avoid picking up curse cards. Another claw... So I'll steam berry. I think we'll take the other claw. This is this is going well. <clears throat> uh, so here we'll definitely need to smith our um, cards that decrease energy. So for example, dual cast and zap. That's our top priority to get the unceasing top going. Um, yet yeah, let's upgrade another card. We could also trans. Oh, I already clicked it. It's gonna say we could also transform a card. All right. Um, one more upgrade. Um, yeah, yeah, let's upgrade Recycle. Perfect. Alright, now chances of us drawing a card... Oh, actually, two more upgrades, Claw and Sunder. Chances of our activating uh, the Unseizing Top is pretty good. Uh, Alright, yeah, let's definitely... Well, see, if we were going for a... Um, for a Cursed, uh, cursed Modifier, we would have picked the other stuff to get the Curse. But again, at this point, I am very skeptical whether or not we would... Like, the Curses would break our Unseizing Top streak and that's kind of what we're going for here um all right so we kill you temporary increase the damage but allow us to get a second card 
and we calculate. So before we had a uh, 18 damage and five defense, a 13 HP loss, and now we had 18 and 10 defense, eight HP loss. So that was definitely a good idea. Um, here we can sunder you, and then recycle a defend and strike claw. Up, oh, perfect kill. I right, got the odd mushroom. Um, vulnerability only affects 25% rather than 50%. Self repair. It is a powerful card, but I don't think we'll take it. Yeah, I don't think we'll take it. I don't really have a good reason, but it's just it's just a weird card. Maybe maybe that was a mistake. Maybe we should have taken it. All right. Let's just see if we got another claw. We did not. Enemy is going to split at thirty three. Um, let's see. But this will already make him split, so I'm gonna wait just one more turn. Actually, we don't have to. I can already. Yeah, why not? Let's let's get him to split. We still had three energy. Yep, this is a problem. Oh well. Um, the claws are pretty powerful at this point. Um, sorry. Let's kill this guy. Deal cast and strike and kill. All right, we got a skill potion as well as double energy. Double energy might be nice. Yeah, let's take it. Since we have the unseasoning top, we could technically go forever. All right, here we'll definitely want to kill the strongest. Um, and then we can... We could kill this with another... Actually, let's target the weakness guy first. Otherwise, we'll get weakness and I'll be just super annoying. All right, unfortunately, we got the double energy on a very unfortunate turn. Oh, well, I think we can still kill you. All right. Uh, I also think that we should... Well, I'm not sure if we can play this card if we don't have anything in our hand. I'm going to try. Okay, we can. All right. That allows it to kill. Okay, charge battery is good. Good defense card. Yeah, let's take it. Okay. Oof, bad, tough luck. Enemies came right on the first turn. All right, let's zap. I'm not sure if this counts towards the uh, perfecting elites, but just in case it does, let's uh, fully defend. Uh, I don't think we'll recycle. Actually, yeah, let's recycle the strike. I don't think we'll need that much strike. All right, and then let's target the weaker one. All right. So we still have all three claws in our deck. All right, so Sunder does kill. Perfect. Thank you. Thankfully, it was upgraded. Uh, and then uh, let's target this guy. Why not? Dual cast. All right, perfect. So we are continuing to perfect. I will play double energy. Why not? Now the curses might um, be an issue. Or not the curses, the status effects we had. Yeah, unfortunately, due to this, it's probably going to be a longer game because gonna cycle through a lot of cards all right um, we can fully defend all right and kill okay we got bronze kills uh, at the start of your uh, ah, at the start of each combat gain three thorns um, I'm also gonna take the uh, I think I need the poison potion I'll take the uh, essence of steel and then here yeah FTL I mean I'm embracing the uh, unseasoned top here okay so um, Double energy. Um, we can't actually. Can we get somebody down to? We can, right? Yeah, we can get all of our energy back. Fully defend, and then start the unseizing top cycle. All right. So here we'll do FTL first. Recycle the actually charge battery only gives us seven defense, right? Um, tough. I think we'll recycle the strike. Charge battery, strike, defend. Field cast. Perfect. Zap. Law. Alright, and now we might get status effects. Alright. We didn't, but still. Um, strike. Uh, yeah, no need to play anything else. And FTL for a kill. Perfect. Alright, Toxic Egg. Whenever you obtain a skill card, it is upgraded. 
Um, Seek would get up, actually. Yeah, it will work on Seek. Now, um, yeah, we'll take it. I, I can't really think of a specific card that we want to see constantly, but I mean, Claws, that's just sort of by default. Actually, who's our final boss? I think we can do it. Um, so here, let's upgrade the double energy. That's another card that just helps with our unseizing top. And thankfully, this boss doesn't put any sort of status effects in our deck. So let's be a little careful about what we want to exhaust with the recycle this early on. But I think, given that we have a lot of attacks and not super many defense, we'll recycle the strike. Um, let's dual cast, law defend, sunder. All right. Okay. So this is a problem. Since we um, have a bunch of strike cards, we won't be able to attack without getting hit back. Let's see what the skill potion is. Okay, this is good. Um, so I think I want... Actually, no, it's still not going to save us. Um, I'll recycle the strike. But unfortunately, we'll have to take 6 damage. I should have actually played the FDL first, because that would have given us the opportunity to draw a uh, defend. Or, I guess, seeked a defend. Let's get double energy in. Much battery. Yeah, unfortunately, we're not perfecting this elite. This uh, boss, sorry. I'm just blindly just pressing one of my keyboard. Alright. Okay, defend, defend, claw, strike, strike. Recycle, nothing. Zap. Defend. Claw. Another claw. Alright. Yeah, it. this was just a weird enemy. Like, it would have been very hard to perfect it based on our current build. So we are relying on sort of just getting rid of all of our cards in our hand. We can't really do that if um, pressed and turned there a little too quickly, but luckily it was fine. Our claws are up to 17, by the way. Um, so let's recycle. Oh, wait. Since when do we get two recycles? I didn't even notice that. Let's recycle one of the recycles. Um, and then charge battery, defend claw. Defend. And one more claw. And Sunder ends our streak. Alright, perfect. Yeah, unfortunately we didn't perfect this elite, but I feel good about our our deck. Uh, Meteor Strike is going to be great for recycling, actually. But I think chances of... Uh, it might also just kill our turn if we don't, if we draw it too early without the recycling. Um, buffer is powerful only if we really get an energy relic. I don't think any of these really work into our deck, though. Yeah, we might draw buffer and it will break our uh, unceasing top uh, roll. Ooh, we did get the only energy relic is Coffee Drip again. Energy at the start of each turn. You can no longer rest at rest sites. Runic Pyramid. Mm, doesn't really do anything bad for us. We might want to take it. Uh, and Nuclear a Battery also isn't great. Well, it does give us free energy, basically. It's, it's like a free energy relic. Huh. I think we'll go with Nuclear Battery. I mean, Runic Pyramid doesn't... Like, it's a neutral one. It doesn't do harm. It doesn't do anything, really. Nuclear Battery actually gives us energy, whereas this gives us energy with some harm. Let's take Nuclear Battery. Alright, let's see. I think I saw one Elite there. Uh, Yep, just one again. Alright, we have to make sure... I think we perfected the previous one, right? Yeah. I forget, did we? Yeah, I think we did. Alright, let's start off doubling energy. Yeah, now I'm thinking we might have actually picked up the meter strike because chances of us actually using it wasn't that low. And we have tons of energy now. We can seek a uh, Sunder even. Yeah, sure, why not? And a Claw. We're almost killing him. I'm really impressed. I didn't expect this. Yeah, perfect. Alright, dexterity potion, which we don't really need, as well as um, 
Yeah, we, we have to avoid any sort of curses until we can play them. Which we can't right now. Alright, so here let's recycle another strike. Defend, claw, strike. Double energy, sure. Let's seek... Uh, I kind of want to seek both claws. Actually, let's do the claw and the sunder. So, this would give us all of our energy back. Yeah, the only disadvantage with this is it's just taking a long time. Alright. There we go. Give me a claw. Nope. I'm thinking maybe I should get rid of the Sunder too, because it does break some of our nice combos. Um, sweeping Beam is a good attack card. What's a draw? We don't need a draw. That's definitely something that we don't need. Um, again, yeah, Curses will just kill us here. We have to avoid taking Curses. It's unfortunate because we're missing out on the Curse modifier. Alright, Leap, Zap. Zap. Upgrade Zap is actually a good idea. Because it's basically... Wait. Did I just see an upgrade and non-upgraded card together? Huh. Interesting. That might be a bug. Because Zap is a skill. We should get it upgraded, right? Yeah. Alright, that's probably a bug. I'll, I'll make a report on Discord later. Um, okay, so... Uh, yeah, let's just play everything. Double energy. This was a little wasted there, but oh well. Oh, we are actually not... I... Huh, never realized that we're not fully defended. A rare turn where we weren't able to either kill or fully defend. Alright, let's FTL. Um, Sunder is not enough to kill just yet, so let's um, claw and then seek... The other claw as well as a dual cast. Claw, dual cast. Alright. Um, we can actually recycle the Sunder. Actually, no, let's do the damage. We can recycle the defend. Alright, just need a few claws. Maybe just one claw even. There we go. Alright. Uh, region push we already have. Yeah, I don't think I'll take any of these. We could actually take a leap and then just remove one of the defense later. That's probably a better idea. Um, here, I think we'll just um, I think we'll just upgrade the claws now. We should obviously continue picking them up if we get them. But uh, let's target the weakest one here. Claw. Unfortunately, we won't be able to really get our start our uh, chain started. So we had four one energy cards in our opening hand. All right, let's see how this goes. So claw, strike, strike, zap. Let's seek. We could dual cast. Actually, double energy is probably more appropriate. Let's do double energy and do and dual cast. Dual cast. No, wait. Let's do zap and dual cast, and then hope we get double energy, because that way we would. Increase our energy by way more. Alright. We did gain two extra energy. I'm just determined to not lose HP this turn. Well, definitely not lose HP. I mean to actually kill this turn. Not losing HP is easy. Killing might be challenging. I should really... I'm, I'm, I'm looking at stuff. I should really just press... One and um Oh there we go. End of chain. Yeah, I should just really press one for to play the first card and then um just click. There we go. Another recycle. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Um let's upgrade the last claw here. Let's see what we get here. Anchor, uh, gain ten block at the beginning of each combat. Um, okay, we have two recycles here. Um, well, let's zap, dual cast, defend. Um, I think we just have to recycle one of them. I, will, I wasn't really, I didn't really want to recycle any of the others. Alright. 
Unfortunately, we draw Sunder this late. Would have helped us out a lot. Okay, we have 27 plus 8 incoming. So let's see what we're gonna do. Um, let's seek the double energy for sure. And the other claw. Alright. Uh, so then let's get rid of this guy. Okay, and then just... I'm just gonna press 1. We are fully defended already. Alright. Okay, uh, so here I think we can just do Sunder, why not? 32 damage. Wait, how did I get so much energy? I wasn't paying attention. Did Sunder give me my energy back? Yeah, I thought I had 5 energy, I played Sunder, then Strike, Strike. That's weird. I'll look back at the footage, that might be another bug. Weird that I'm seeing so many bugs today. Alright, here, um, let's not... Let's try to get rid of these guys before they become a problem. Oh, I pressed end turn. Well, that's fine. No harm done. Okay, let's see if we can kill. We can, perfect. Alright, we did perfect this elite. We also got Vajra, start each combat with one strength, which is handy, as well as another recycle? It doesn't harm anything, right? No, it'll be too... Oh, actually, it would give us the uh, collector bonus if we have four of them. We also have three claws already. Let's get it. There is our fourth claw, so that's our collector bonus right there. Um... Panache is going to be extremely powerful, but it is also super expensive. Uh, I I think we'll take it, though. It's just ridiculously powerful. In our deck, we're playing tons of cards at all times. Uh, here, let's remove a defend. I picked up one of... Uh, I picked up the upgraded leap, particularly just so I can remove the defend later. Yeah, I mean, okay, look at this. So, double energy. Panache. We have to play Sunder, unfortunately. Strike, defend. And now we'll just play everything we get. And every ten card, or every five cards we play is gonna make do, do ten damage to the enemy. So this is just ridiculously powerful. Even though it did cost two hundred golds more than more than some relics. Um, well, oh, I guess I hadn't accounted for the fact that this Neko will confuse us. Um, yeah, that was my mistake. I should have played the vulnerability potion first. We would have saved 8 HP, but it's fine. Um, recursion is nice. It's upgraded, zero cost. Yeah, let's take it. We can take any zero cost card at this point, I guess. <clears throat> I also think, I am starting to think that we should get rid of our Sunder. It is just um, too often sort of not allowing us to continue our nice streak. I'm just gonna, again, click on the Centurion. Alright. That was successful, I would say. Alright. <clears throat> um, okay, Zap, Recursion, Recycle, the Leap, Defend. There's the Panache. Oops. I, did I? Oh, I guess I couldn't see because I didn't have anything in my draw pile. Alright, there we go. Kill thanks to Panache. Uh, Alright, none of these. Let's see. Um, I'm not sure. 70 or 30%. Let's go Let's go risky. Go big or go home. And I win. I won the bet. Awesome. Alright, here we'll upgrade the uh, other claw. Actually, we should upgrade the Panache. Yeah, I don't think... We already have three upgraded claws, so we can upgrade the Panache instead. All right, this is the test. Um, double energy. Uh, let's recycle a strike. Zap and strike. And just go through this. We don't need defense because we're already... Oops, I could... Okay, so we're going to seek the panache. As well as... Uh, what should we seek? Doesn't really matter. Uh, as well as a claw, I guess. All right, I'm just going to play the first card I get it immediately.
Oh, there's the end of our... Are we not able... Oh my god. Oh, this is upsetting. We are unable to um, continue our streak because we got Sunder. Ooh. So we are unfortunately unable to perfect this elite. This boss. Uh, that was... We definitely have to get rid of Sunder. I think that was, that was a mistake. Yeah, again, again, Sunder is just a problem. Unless we recycle it, it's a problem. I mean, once we recycle it, it's handy. But unless we do, it is a problem. So we definitely have to get rid of it. All right, I, I do feel confident we can kill this turn, though. Unless we draw another Sunder. Oh, there we go. All right, that was, that was sad. Um, here, we'll definitely take the all for one. That's just super handy, especially in our deck, although it might break our um, our chains. <laughs> Velvet Choker would be the death. Um, we don't really need the Inserter. I think we'll go with Blackstar. None of these relics were really good. All right, Time Eater, I see. I think I see one or two elites. So, nope, I just saw one. All right, one elite here. This explains the low score. All right, um, so we can play everything, right? I guess we have to decide if we want to play the Thunder now. Uh, wow, we are getting a lot of hits here. Uh, we are only protected against... Well, we're going to get six damage at least. Um, yeah, let's just play it. Uh, let's target the weakest. Alright, these two are still attacking. Let's double our energy, and then let's start our chain. So zap, recycle, recycle again. Blah, you. Nash, thank you. Zap. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm probably going to speed this up, too. Alright. We got Liquid Bronze, which I don't think we'll take, as well as none of these. I did see, I think this is the third dark uh, darkness I saw in this game. Uh, here, let's get rid of a Strike, Zap, Charge Battery, Dual Cast. Blah. Let's go through all these cards again. Oh, thanks to, uh, what was it, all, of, all for one, we got all of our zero cost cards back. Which is great. Um, here, let's double energy and sunder to get it out. Alright. Okay, um... Well, Steam Barriers block. Um, yeah, I think we can take and remove uh, one of the other blocks. Alright, Panache. Um, let's play both claws before we play the all for one. Actually, I guess we can play everything here. So let's target you. All for one for a kill here. Getting all of our claws back. Alright, double energy. Uh, yeah, we can attack safely. Alright. So, rebound might be nice. Yeah, rebound is great, especially if we get it together with Claws. Here, um... I'm actually... A lot of the uh, colorless cards are zero cost, so let's see what we get. Another Panache. Yes. Trip might have been nice, too. Um, I'm not sure if we need this. Yeah, there is a risk of not drawing a zero cost um, colorless card, so I think we'll go with Panacea. And here, I think we'll go Sadistic Nature. Yeah. Also, was that a bug, too? Sadistic Nature should have been... Oh, never mind. It's a power. All right, here, um, I am thinking of getting, well, let's remove the Sunder. Uh, it has, I mean, it burned me, literally burned me on a boss, so we want to get rid of it. Even though it's upgraded, I know, it's, it's yeah. 
Um, it was definitely more useful on the first floor. Um, and then I don't think we have another shop upcoming, right? Well, there are two question marks, but chances of them being a shop, not super high. I think we'll try to spend all of our energy uh, or uh, gold now. Um, I don't, none of these cards are amazing. So I think I'll just take the um, shovel. Yeah. Although I don't even want to. Well, let's let's dig for relic. The only thing I would want to upgrade was the um, pan, uh, panache. Uh, but uh, it's fine. Let's just dig. Choose a bracelet that we can no longer encounter regular enemies in uh, question room marks, uh, question mark rooms. All right. Wow. Both panaches in the opening hand. That's awesome. All right. Let's see if we can kill this turn because next turn might be hard. All right. Not bad. Okay. So in here we have 18 incoming. Ooh, and we got burns in our deck. That is going to be a problem. Who's our final boss actually? Oh, this time eater. He does he put no, he doesn't. I don't think he puts voids in our deck. I think we should be fine. Um, Rishakas will be handy if we draw them together, which is questionable. So, um, I'm gonna, I don't think I recycle anything. I'll rebound the zap recycle. Zap again. All right. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, we can we can just play everything. Uh, we probably don't need that many zaps there. Oh, FTL is also kind of useless. I mean, FTL is just a zero cost card, so that's kind of why I like it. All right, we are fully defended. Let's seek. Um, Oh, well, yeah, another claw. Recursion, why not? We're just doing one HP damage at this point. Kind of inclined to just stop our turn. And what I'll do, I'll wait till our uh, deck is uh, fully cycled through, and then I'll stop our turn. Maybe draw one card. Actually, I guess we can do this until we hit a um, burn. That we will sort of eliminate one of the burns from our... Yeah, there we go. All right, we have one less burn to think about. Okay. Recycle the strike. And let's just, yeah, this was an issue. We have 18 incoming, there's nothing we can do, right? Yeah, we need an energy uh, potion. That's really what we need there. Yeah, that's just unfortunate. Well, at least our claws are super upgraded. Okay, we did not perfect this elite. I can't really think of a way we could have. I mean, the all in uh, all in one is a, just a ridiculously good card. We don't want to lose it, especially in this deck. Anyway, we got the boot. Whenever you would deal four or less unblocked damage, gain a um, or sorry, increase the attack damage to five, as well as Centennial Puzzle. Whenever you get damaged for the first time. Draw three cards. I think here we get another charge battery. Somewhat secretly hoping for the um, collector bonus for that. Uh, here, let's seek. Uh, we're not getting attached, but let's seek both panaches. Panache eye. Um, leap. Recycle the strike and defend. And just play everything we get. All right. Ooh, one more claw. Or another steam barrier. I think I'll go with claw. Yeah, it's just powerful. Why not, right? I guess if we got lucky and picked... Oh, this is great. Omomori, uh, negate the next two curses you get. Because we might get two curses. And let's actually see what potions we get. Oh, I was going to say, because I would definitely take a uh, energy potion. That's the one weakness that we have in our deck currently. Um, again, I think we'll dig. Let's see what we get. Pendip, every 10th attack you play, it deals double damage. Now, this I will definitely have to cut, because this might take forever. We actually have a reasonable chance of uh, killing him, too.
All right, so I think this might have been the first time I actually beat the transient. And another claw. Jeez. All right. It was a... Uh, you might have noticed as, as I, I, I speeded it up, but um, I was definitely not paying attention to par part of that fight. I was just pressing, pressing one and, and mouse click. All right, here, let's uh, recycle a strike. Let's leap, charge, batter, defend. And uh, let's get this going again. All right. Ooh, yeah, the the status effects and the burns are gonna harm us for sure. Let's actually uh, let's first draw cards. I'm trying to use the seek. Um, double energy. Uh, sadistic nature. Yeah, I think we'll seek the two panaches and hope for the best. Where's the other one? Do we already? No, here. Um, panache, panache. Defend church battery. Recursion. Claw. Recycle. Yeah, this is. Well, if we get one one of the status effects now, it's it's it'll be very sad because we have eleven energy. Matter of time. Oh, all for one. Awesome. Claw, claw, FTL. There we go. All right, ice cream. Oh, this is even better. Energy is not conserved between turns, as well as the swift potion, which I don't think we really need. And uh, I don't think we need any of these either. Okay, let's see what you bring. So um, let's rebound the claw um, and recycle the defend. There we go. All right, energy potion. We definitely want that over the uh, regen potion, maybe. Over the... Uh, I can't decide. Over the regen potion, yeah. So, I think... Well, do we have another? We don't. Okay, no reason to pick up another charge battery. Um, here, let's do one last dig. Potion belt. All right, that's pretty useless at this stage. Now, the time eater is going to be a problem because we can't do our nice uh, sequence anymore. Uh, let's seek out the panache, the other panache at least, and there's no reason, well, I guess, no reason, well, we can double our energy, why not? Um, yep. Alright, panache, double energy. Yeah, so we have to make sure that we play all of our, um, all of the allocated 12 cards and hope that we get enough defensive cards. All right, I should have also just played the uh, Fear Potion. I'm not sure why I didn't do that. And uh, I guess we can play the Essence of Steel there. All right, let's FTL first. Rebound the uh, Claw. Leap, Zap, Claw. All right, now here we just have to hope for defensive cards. Otherwise, we won't be able to perfect this, uh, this guy either. This is not what I had in mind. Yeah, I don't think we can perfect this. We might not even be able to survive. Well, let's just do as much damage as we can. All right, our pendant is active next turn. Okay. Um, well, this has good damage. Uh, let's recycle. Uh, to recycle out, charge battery. Recycle. Oh, actually, I don't want to recycle anything here because I do want all the defenses that I get. Yeah, see, the turn where we don't need defense, we get tons of defense. Yeah, I wonder, I mean, we're not going to have a high score because we didn't perfect any of the bosses. Actually, no, we did. Yeah, no, none of, none of the bosses. It's actually going to be a very low score, but let's actually first play the two claws. Oh, never mind, we killed already. Um, and I'm trying to think how we could have, I think maybe the better way was to sort of focus on eliminating any card except for defense cards. Uh, maybe picking up a couple more. Oh, wow. 801. That's pretty low. It was an interesting run. It wasn't super entertaining um, because it was just basically cycling through, but it was an interesting run. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.